when I look back, when I was younger, when I was a kid, I had to fight uh, against raci racism. I was abused in, in my childhood. I always tried to ignore it so because I, I didn't have the tools to fight it. And now today uh, I'm older, I have the tools, I have the possibility. And um, that's why I said I have to do something against it because I always said I wanted my kids to grow up not knowing what racism is. And it happened in a friendly game when I played in uh, AC Milan that um, 50 people were, were chanting some insult, racist insults, doing monkey, uh, monkey chants. And uh, I decided to, to not play anymore because I wanted to, to show the people that in these in this, uh, situations, I don't want to play football anymore. So, and the, the, the amazing thing was that my whole team followed me and took the stand with me. Everybody backed me up because I think it was like what the world needed, that someone really showed the world that uh, it's enough. We still suffer today, like we suffered 2013 and in the past before. Uh, that drives me every day to do something against it. To be an icon on something, to fight something so big, is very difficult, but I take the challenge. I want to help uh, as much as I can, and um, I want to bring people together who suffer the same, and we, we, have to, we have to stand against it. Players, the media, we have a big role to play, and we have to use that big stand, what we have like the big possibility. We have to use it much more and we have to use it, how I said, every single day. I just want the people to speak up. Don't be quiet anymore because we've been quiet for so long. I've been quiet when I was younger, but I've learned to use my words and to, to fight against it. Just fight, don't give up, because uh, when we're united, no one can stop us.